if you're addicted to pressure, you become your own pressure monger. You, you right, hold this pressure over yourself. I know I certainly did. But then you also become the pressure monger to others. You know, imposing, you know, pressure on others to perform or get things done the way in not a natural time. You become a grace robber. You've robbed yourself of grace. Something I had to learn was that letting go, letting go and seeking truth was the only way out. And when I say seeking truth as a way out of being addicted and just at the effect of pressure is and operating on pressure, being seeking the truth is being authentic. Being authentic is difficult, but being authentic is a path of truth because you have to tell the truth on yourself. Tell the truth about being addicted. I had to tell the truth, like, Baron, you are addicted to pressure. You can't function without it. Like, look, you can't get off the couch without some kind of pressure, some kind of external, like the question I brought up, the, some kind of external motivation or consequence. I needed something external I wasn't flowing from within myself, but authenticity is the pathway to freedom. So when I say letting go and seeking truth was the only way out, seeing the truth, having a, an appetite, a hunger, a thirst for the truth and the way out, you know, yearning for freedom and through authenticity, telling the truth and then letting go. When you see in the moment, in real time, in real situations, real interactions with yourself, with people, with others, with situations, you see yourself giving into pressure or relating related to pressure. In that moment, you let that go, you step in front of it, and you be about the truth. No, the truth is I'm going to be real here. I'm going to show up real. Authenticity is an access to freedom. It's a pathway to freedom. It's a gateway to freedom and freedom from what? In this case, the pressure that is ruining your joy. <laughs> it's pouring salt on any kind of just natural joy and the vitality to flow freely in life. But the journey for me was seeking the truth, acknowledging the truth, being authentic about it, being authentic about where I'm not, including being authentic with others. Like, hey, I didn't. I'm not showing up here in a real way because I, I'm stressed out and full of anxiousness and anxiety and knots because of, you know, I, I, I'm, I've got all this pressure about this thing or this situation or this project or this presentation. And so just start telling the truth on yourself is a big one, I see, as a way out. At a certain point, I saw how pressure was running my life running my energy, which was basically my life force was cut off. <laughs> my flow was cut off. I was stressed. I was overwhelmed. I got to a point where I was like, dear God, like just in prayer, just my soul calling out, God, I want ease. Show me the way to ease and simplicity. And, and I'll tell you what I saw. Eventually, I saw that the less I needed pressure to motivate and function, the less I needed to just get things done, the less I needed to prepare for something, and the less I needed to prepare to prepare. Meaning, if I saw, okay, I was going to give a talk or go and lead some kind of training or some kind of development course or program, I would, yeah, there's some preparation to do there. But... It was simple. It was easeful. It was joyful. It was a, a creative act. In, but I, I didn't need a lot. I had what I needed to just kind of gather my thoughts, put things in order. The blanket of overwhelm and pressure began to lift. As I gave things up that I thought I, I thought I needed pressure, actually. And the more I gave that up, the more it gave me up. It just you know, I could let it be there. Okay, I could see, feel pressure in the background knocking on my door, knocking on my head. And I was like, the more I just let it be, it would let me be. And I got to more freedom and ease. And as this transformation becomes real, became real for me, just that old pressure pattern or that old pattern to need pressure and deal with pressure was replaced with 
just a whole new way of being, acting, new way of generating and creating in life.